similar situation had occurred as many yeah, as sure eight times prior. Many considered EDP. What? Eight, to eight they times They did this eight times. Sick. Hell That's no. just a sick individual. <laughs>
is a razz if he makes a video about you, bro. Situation. Creators who supported him in the past, such as some ordinary gamers, would upload a video titled EDP 445 needs to be arrested immediately. Why has EDP been dropping hard? Because EDP is an individual that actually got Chris Hansen. And after it was revealed that a similar situation had occurred as many yeah, as sure eight did. times prior, many considered EDP unforgivable and his life would suffer. Eight times prior? A state of chaos. Wait, what? Eight, to eight they times prior? Did this eight times. Sick. Hell That's no. just a sick individual, man. Else, <laughs> what you might call the beginning <laughs> of the end. Oh my god. In the seven days following the expose, EDP445 would lose 200,000 subscribers, almost 10% of his entire count. However, how many followers he lost initially didn't actually matter, because seven days later, his remaining 2 million subscribers would disappear entirely after YouTube decided to ban his account altogether. At the time of his banning, EDP it. was exactly 30 years old, and had been creating content since 2010 mm. when he was 19 years old. So the 179 million views deleted in the yeah, process I meant that his entire great. portfolio of work completed in his 20s, 10 plus years worth of labor was wiped Crazy. out quite literally overnight. One mistake was all it took for YouTube to decide that EDP445 no longer deserved either his celebrity status or any kind of record relating to any of his work completed in the past. Another method that EDP had for earning an online income was Cameo. You could order a personalized video and get EDP to say anything bro, you instructed him to at like the price of 40 He just looked like a sick dude, bro. Yeah, bro. I I we should have known, I, bro. We should have known. I don't feel bad, bro. Like you feel bad? No, not not for him. I feel bad for his fans that probably you know the people that used to watch him. And Why do you feel um, bad for him? who cares? Bro? Because like thing. imagine, uh, yeah, like imagine, like telling everybody, "Yo, man, I've been watching EDP." And then, like a month later, you get sent a video of him. Yeah, I guess. like being a, yeah. a weirdo. Like, I feel bad for the people that watch him, bro. I don't feel bad for nobody in the situation. I don't feel bad, Except for bro, a vic maybe if he has any victims, yeah, but I don't think he did. I think he just he is sick. I've seen a video him. with him with like he's like he's like a porn addict too, bro. Bro, he, I watched you. He, he, he made that clear. Yeah, he made that clear in his like in his videos, but everybody was just like <laughs> laugh at it, think it's jokes and stuff. But that's it's, funny. Actually it's funny when you don't when the person not actually a weirdo. Like when the person not yeah, actually, we didn't think like, they were serious. We didn't even think he was serious or that stuff. But then I don't know if y'all watched, but I watched like that whole video that those guys made about him, like exposing him. Crazy stuff, bro. I watched that whole thing. I remember. Cause I was like, yo, ain't no way. Cause I was like, cause like I was like, I watched this dude when I was growing up, you know. Like yeah. I was like, ain't no way. I was like, mm. this dude's sick, bro. Immediately on subscribe. I don't, I don't know. I don't at all. That's not my situation. I was just, I was like, and the dudes that exposed him too aren't the best guys either. By the way, yeah, you know, yeah, they, yeah, they aren't. They were like little racist and stuff, but a little racist. And I, I think one of them. Well, yeah, they were very racist. racist. Yeah, I'm just girl. saying. Oh, yeah, I don't know about that. Enough, I, I didn't. I didn't, I didn't really look into them that much, but I just heard stuff like that. I didn't. I didn't look into that. Much. I don't say much about it. But yeah, he is. Yeah. <laughs> However, following the infamous cupcake event, Cameo would be contacted by numerous individuals who would receive responses along the lines of, hey there, thank you for reaching out. Our team is aware of the allegations and are actively investigating this. Thank you for bringing it to our attention, kindly Melita. Less than a week later, EDP445's Cameo account was deleted. Another income stream had gone up in smoke. EDP445 then attempted to switch to Facebook. However, after gaining 6,000 followers, he'd be banned from the platform. It was the same story over on Instagram. Bro, if you're somebody that's still following him, bro, after all that, you're sick. I mean, too, no one, he you're got nothing. Too, there's bro. really, there's bro, really nowhere enough. to follow him, but. Yeah, he has but I'm saying, like, he, they said he got 6,000 followers on Facebook. I could get 6,000 yeah, followers. No. Like, if you're one of those 6,000, you're sick. You're yeah. sick. Yeah. Just as bad as him, almost. But yeah, and I'm interested <laughs> to see, I'm interested to see what he says, because he said living he out of a suitcase. Living, no, I'm, I'm talking about the oh, person talking about, yeah, yeah. the video, because living out of a suitcase, because I know YouTube money is good money. So it doesn't like it feels like he should still have money to sit on. I don't yeah, know. He should if he's being but smart we'll, we'll with see. It. I'm, I'm sure. He'll explain boys. It. <laughs> his main account was terminated. Freak ass which boy. Point, ADP was likely coming to terms don't with cry. the harsh reality of his cancellation. <laughs> However, just before his Facebook was deleted, <laughs> 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 he planned on making his own website. <laughs> Bro, <I> said, <laughs> don't cry. Yeah. EDP four four five announced over on Facebook that he will be making his grand return to the internet with his own website to return to his old video type. I guess. Just want to let you guys know, man. EDP four four five dot com. 
Um, it's coming soon. Been been about like a week, maybe two weeks. Man, shut your bitch ass up. EDP four four five seemingly got to the point of fully building the website, as discussed by Tipster here on YouTube. It still says coming soon. Still says today's date. It does look like EDP is actually serious about this whole launching a website thing. However, after an apparent hey, out with his website developer, as mentioned in a Reddit comment, the launch seemed to fail. Update, the website is now returning an error 500. So it looks like he's he having think? a little bit of trouble launching the site. Hasn't been working so well for him. And to this day, the page remains as an unlaunched inactive website. In spite of how much of a scumbag EDP445 truly was, you have to give him about. credit for sheer determination because he then began to upload videos on another third party website called 3 TV, where his account would be met with the same fate. It was banned. He wrote, he for some reason, done? my channel was deleted. For I don't have reason. a clue what's going for on. I didn't reason. violate any guideline. Can you please tell me what's going on? EDP. After this ban, it seemed as though EDP4 Fly was slowly getting the message from each and every website. His career on the internet was finished. However, the internet wasn't finished with ending his career. Rich from Review Tech USA would state that he might be able to get a job working somewhere like Starbucks. However, it was only going to be so long before the trolls would come and inform them of his past. But I don't even know if you could get a damn job at Starbucks and keep it because you know the trolls are going to come after you and say, oh yeah, that guy you just hired, I wouldn't keep him employed. You'd probably lose a job at that coffee shop too real quick. Rich would be correct sure. in this statement. EDP 445 moved from Bakersfield, California to Henderson, Nevada following the expose, where it seemed as though he managed to land a job as a Lyft driver in October 2021. However, this job would be fairly short-lived, as a video posted to TikTok by a user called Lennon. Imagine Newman, you get the lift and you see this nigga, Lyft bro. profile. Bro went from wanting cupcakes to driving for Lyft. And his position as a driver would subsequently be removed by the company. The situation would promote Reddit discussion with one post stating EDP as a Lyft driver, how the mighty have fallen, which received comments such as, can you take me to the grocery store? I'ma go buy some cupcakes. And I hope he doesn't get on any food delivery apps. MF would eat my fries and I'd have missing slices of pizza. However, on, somewhat man. hilariously, it was revealed shortly thereafter that EDP had in fact been driving for both Uber Eats and Grubhub, which would also- I'd be pissed off. Finding out about <laughs> yeah. I'd be pissed off. It's gonna be seven fries in your bag. For Grubhub and Uber Eats, and all three of those companies, Fired him. According to a very basic unconfirmed source, EDP also apparently applied a Chuck E. Cheese, but for obvious Damn reasons. Bad. Like, pause that. the video. Pause that. Bro, you know how down bad a nigga has to beat up by <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese? That's so bad, bro. Bro, you know your life is going All you're going to see is kids in a, in a, in a massive... That's what he wants uh, to see. Yeah, that's, bro, what he like, want, that's what he wants to see, bro. And that's, yeah, that's bro. I'm so glad he did that job, I'm so yeah, like Chuck E. Cheese costume, bro. <laughs> no longer have the ability to make money in real life, as this revealed. Unless he were to find some extremely low skill niche job where they wouldn't check his name online and where he wouldn't have to interact with any customers who might expose him to whichever what job is that? Working for. <laughs> Which only works for his own way of finding bro. even the most. <laughs> oh, my God. Be a janitor or something, to find bro. Out you can't even be a janitor. I'm like at a gas station. The application showed that he was a four Brian Morland applied for a name change with the Nevada County Court on the 21st of October 2021. The strange part about this is that when you try and search the court register from the Reddit post by typing in his name, Bryant Morland, it now states that there are no results found, possibly indicating that EDP445's name change has been successful and he's no longer known as Bryant Morland. As you can see, I did type in his name, Morland Bryant, submit, no results found. However, the problem with this, as outlined by the ADP 445 subreddit, oh, no, no, that, what is our play? You play and it records. You're gonna have to get ad blocker. Yeah. Uh, we don't have, we have, we don't have, we don't have we'll, we'll this out, we'll this out. Nah, nah, B. But he's not exactly hard to spot. This idiot thinks this will fix anything, Lameo. He will be spotted everywhere no matter his name. He should flee to Cuba or something like this. Changing his name isn't a good idea since it's gonna get leaked anyways. What good does changing a name do when you're as easily recognizable as him, lol? He needs to lose hundreds of pounds and get a hair transplant. Perhaps the goal is to have not his name wrong. hidden long enough wrong. in order to get a job, as other sources state that he's been, stuff. unsurprisingly, struggling with money. He's broke. Like, 
YouTube made them money, but after why a nigga play a subway I'm surfer saying. Bro, <laughs> real quick? A user by the name of Master at Work, who was one of the people trying to expose EDP all the way back in 2020, stated in October that EDP had less than $3,300 cash left. They know that. Plus two cars and a couple yeah. of other things. In How do you know that, bro? How the only income that he has, other than the 3300 like that he has left in his bank it. account, is maybe the 40 grand in weapons and the two cars that he owns. However, in a two months, yeah, 40 grand over, in weapons. users on Reddit used his oh, car's right, license well, plate crazy. to confirm that EDP 445 has sold one of his cars, possibly indicating that his cash. Nah, okay, okay. that's crazy. In the same him, live stream during which yeah. Master at Work would discuss EDP's financial situation, it also mentioned that EDP had been evicted from his apartment complex as the property owner received numerous complaints about having him as a tenant. Call up Spur Apartments and verify for yourself. Um, EDP will no longer be living at Spur Apartments. The reason why he got evicted is because of a cons constant harassment the property owner has been getting. Since then, EDP has been mm. living out of a suitcase at various hotels. However, even then, his detractors have been going around trying to get him kicked out of wherever he happens to be staying. He's a beast. Uh, hey, what is wild is yeah. that? There, I will be more than happy to let them know. Thank you very much. EDP's detractors have made his life such a living hell that if anything, an they arrest are. or a short stint in prison would almost make his circumstances more comfortable. We'll preface this part by stating that there have been numerous accounts of EDP being arrested. However, they never seem to have any rock solid proof to go along with it. So take everything said in the next that, section man. with a grain of salt. In late October, a YouTuber by the name of Matt Simon seemed confident that EDP had been arrested, yet provided no evidence or reason for the arrest. EDP has been arrested. Today is October 25th. Man, this, it is 11.30 at EDP has Come been on, arrested. Bro. I chatted. Or five in jail. In this video, Felipe explained that while out having dinner, he'd get a call Felipe from would know that. number stating Felipe that it was EDP 445 who was being held at the Henderson, Nevada Detention Center. So the third time I picked up, uh, I was like, you know, hello. And it said, uh, this is uh, the Henderson, Nevada uh, Detention Center inmate for for Brian Moreland. Would you like to receive the, the call? And I like hung up, you know, and then called again. And the same, the same thing happened, you know, would like to receive a call. So I, pre I said yes, because I was like, you know, I was just curious to see like, holy sh like he got arrested. Like, like, wow. You know, the issue is the only yeah. evidence that he's able to provide is for no caller ID calls on his iPhone, which isn't exactly rock solid evidence to say yeah. the least. And Felipe's character yeah. is suspect at best. He only gets views when he talks about ADP 445 and without it ADP on the internet to defend himself, anyone can say anything. Additionally, if ADP did successfully change his name in October or November, as mentioned previously, this would prove the story to be fake as the guy states that it was Bryant Moreland on the other end of the phone. Sure. One comment stated, looked up every inmate record in Clark County County, which is where Henderson is, Kern County, which is where Bakersfield is, and Manatee County, which is where Bradenton, Florida is, which said that he was connected to online. No Bryant Moreland is in any of those prisons. In the end, it doesn't really matter whether or not he's in actual Yeah, he can't go. Is it safe can, to say that he's a anyway, man who but... made a mistake so bad that even outside of concrete prison walls, he barely has a drop of freedom? All right. So what I will I... say, hang on, what I will say is, I've never been the biggest fan of council culture, but this is where it has its good. It has its good as goods in it. This is Bro. where it's good. All right. Like, I, you know, I feel bad for his fans, but, bro, he got nowhere to stay, bro. Like, I feel like that's just low-key OD. He has nowhere to stay, dog. Like, him, I he doesn't know where to stay, OD, but he should be in jail. I think he should be in jail. Yeah, he should be in jail. his YouTube, everything, all his social media is fine, but, bro, and he's not going to stay, fine too, But he should be in jail. You think, bro? He should be in jail. Because even though right. he's going to get messed up in he, jail too, by the end of the day, he has somewhere to live. He's not. But like, he, he, he has somewhere to even sleep. Even if he, if he got out of jail, bro, where is she going to go? Like, yeah. it's, I've seen a lot of what I mean. situations happen. Like, yeah. bad situations, bro. But I mean, like, I think he's he locked up for life. You see, you I don't mean, think he deserves a, another chance like to turn his life no. around? Or just um, say... At least after, not after a long time. Is it, come, is it because he's famous? Is that why? It's because of what he did. Because if it was up. someone else, if it was someone else, All right, man. you know. I think, y'all let us know in the so. comments. Y'all let us know in the comments what y'all think down below. I mean, I don't think anybody's going to think that he needs, you know, be able to get jobs, especially at Chuck E. Cheese, bro. Like, come on. All yeah, I know is EDP, weird. you're an L. You deserve everything you got coming to you, man.
You but, need a house. Give him a house, though, bro. But <laughs> give him a house. Come on. Yeah, that's all right. End of the day. Rabbit, 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 rabbit. That's uh. That's all we got for y'all today. Hope y'all enjoyed. Hit that like and subscribe. Catch y'all later. Peace. Peace.